everyone, welcome back to another video, and today we are going to look at the brand new truck in American Truck Simulator. Uh, well not new truck, new version of, uh, tr of truck, the, uh, the new Kenworth W900. The 100, the 100th anniversary limited edition version. And you might be asking, why are we starting in a dealership? If we're looking at it, it's well. That's because we um, have uh, some new versions of the truck you can buy. So we're gonna look at those. First off, we have this one. Then this one. So after these, we're just gonna go and look at all the new customizations. But yeah. Uh, these are the new versions of the truck in the dealership. Also this one. So these replaced all the old ones. Then that one, and then the one from the trailer, which is really cool. Yeah, I think I like that one better. Obviously. Anyway, so now let's go uh, back and see all about the uh, new truck. It's basically his new truck because they like changed a lot of it. I wonder if you can still make it look like the old ones. So yeah, we got that one. They removed the uh, sunroof as an option for like all of them. Now you have an option to put it on. It doesn't have to be there. Then we got that cab, which I think was the biggest one before. Now. We got this one. The big one, which looks really nice. I'm just gonna see the interior of each one for a second. And then this one. And then this one. Okay, now, probably gonna go with that. Uh, for chassis, they basically redid the whole thing. I'm gonna go through them all. Uh, uh, so that's short 6x2, 6x2 mid lift, 6x4, uh, medium 6x2, 6x2. Uh, six the 6x2 mid lift, medium 6x4, and then uh, the red, which is probably my favorite, because I really like the look of the red, and it's also a 100th anniversary. Then of course we, we couldn't have it without the triple axis. Then we got a bunch of engines, strongest being 625 horsepower, weakest being 370 horsepower. Um, by the way, Cummins, Packard, and Caterpillar engines. Then we got Eaton and, Eaton and Allison transmissions. And also, I don't know how it's going to work, like, on my other game, I, uh, where I'm level, I think, 42. Um, like, how the other trucks will, like, be, like, that I already owned from before, or if it'll just replace them. So I'm going to check that. Uh, because one thing I noticed on the other ones, the grill was straight up. That one, it's slanted back a bit. So, what I would have done was, I would have kept, like, the old version of the truck and just made all these, like, options put on, but... Yeah, I like that they updated it, anyway. And then for interiors, we have the... Uh, Splen Splendor Slate Gray. And then we have the... 
diamond jet black diamond slate gray and 100th anniversary which is probably my favorite and then it's probably like the Western Star 5700XE where they have the uh, where you can change the seats separately but yeah I like the look of it and then we got a bunch of paint jobs Uh, but the new one that I actually really like right there KW 100th anniversary fancy and then here we got like all these options again and we got those standard there that so we got the we can have Kenworth Kenworth wait. Kenworth Kenworth or epic Kenworth, which I think was what they had on like the old ones. We got the two types of um, of front mirrors, and then we can have the those on. Oh wait, oh they didn't do it. I'm I'm waiting for them to add like the uh. I call it the uh, Kenworth logo front turn light, front turn signals, because they have, uh, they're like a circle, but they have the lines on top and on the bottom, and it's like those, so it's not just a square. But yeah, you got two options there. Uh, there. I don't know what that is. Would that, is that like these? Either way, you only got the uh, standards. Then basic standard white for front mug flaps for the uh, side uh, door steps and have a variety of things I like it looking like that here we also have a bunch of different options for smokestacks you can have it uh, the plain stacks or the standard exhaust or the 100th anniversary versions and there we can have uh, stock or duty versions door handle uh, is just stock window I'm guessing without or with I guess you can only have it with for now Mirrors, uh, same as before, I think. Uh, that is same as before. And for horns, I think it's just the four. Yeah, just the four. And then the lights, you also just have those. Uh, three types of sun visors. Uh, you can have with the window there, or the uh, sunroof, or without. I'm trying to make sure I don't miss anything. Yeah, there's so much stuff to customize in this game. You can have a variety of tank options. Here, uh, you can get a side badge, which they didn't have before, I don't think. You can have the, um, uh, studio sleeper or 100th anniversary sleeper. I mean, studio sleeper badge or 100th anniversary badge. You can get, uh, and here you can get a chrome door, or not, not door, uh, handle for the, uh, sleeper for the sleeper door 
and up top here you can get more lights you can get that uh, wood scoop or that one the big chrome one and you can have some beacons and back there you can have the fairings there you can have a uh, standard window or exclusive window here you can have uh, stock rear fenders or none And with the uh, mud guards, you can have standard, standard white, or Kenworth ones, of course. Uh, there you can have a basic thing, uh, or those. There, um, uh, you can have lights on the back. And there you, uh, you can have it without the grate or with the grate there. Or as they call it, chassis cover. And for mud flaps, you can have white mud flaps, standard mud flaps, SCS mud flaps, or chrome mud flaps. And then you can have a uh, rear bumper. Uh, the uh, chrome modern or the stock one and then um oh you can also have um those and then it's like uh same sort of stuff with all the wheels from before And um, now for interior. So uh, I don't think I'm gonna mess around with all the uh, interior stuff, but for steering wheel we have uh, the Kenworth Classic uh, and the Kenworth Modern. And then uh, for the uh, steer uh, seat, wait. seat you have cloth gray leather black oh wait it also changes back there too uh, um or leather gray and then my favorite the 100th anniversary i really like uh the red with the uh black that looks really sleek Yep. So I think that's about it for a new truck. Or a new version of truck. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.